Hello everyone, it is the day before my first competition, sorry I sound a little hoarse, I've literally just got up, it is half past ten, but I needed to rest as I did some work yesterday, so that was outside all day, so I was really tired, so I am today just going to rest and see my mum, have some lunch, and yeah, see how, how I'm feeling tomorrow, I'm still a bit nervous and I'll be even worse tomorrow but <clears throat> yeah just gonna prepare as well as I can I will take you shopping with me and I'll show you what I'm gonna get for the meet as um I'll put I'm probably gonna be one of the first to be weighed in so then I'll probably about about have around two hours to eat before I actually lift so I'm gonna get some goodies and like things I want to eat. But me knowing me, I'm actually gonna eat food that I know I can eat because I don't want to go out and then like be sick and just be full and not be able to lift. So I'm gonna make some overnight oats probably, and then I'm gonna get one of my favourite sandwiches, and then just some like chocolate and Lucasade and sweets and stuff. But I will show you that later. Um, I'm currently on my water cut, so this is the day when I would drink in the least. I'm drinking about a litre, litre and a bit today. Um, I started off with two, two-ish on Monday, six on Tuesday, six on Wednesday, three-ish yesterday, and one-ish tomorrow. And this means I will hopefully weigh under 52 tomorrow. All being well. So we shall see. Um, so I'm going to go have some breakfast because I'm starving. And yeah, I will show you me making my oats for tomorrow, I think. Okay, bye. I go to every single day, um, chocolate protein and oats. And then this is what I have to drink today. About one litre. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to make my overnight oats now. And I don't know how much to put in or what, but we'll just see. So I'm having one spoon of protein. Then I usually have three grams of oats, but I'm going to see this one. That's ready for tomorrow. Hey, so obviously standing me, I forgot to take my camera shopping. So I will show you what I got now for tomorrow when I get to eat lids. Okay, so this is my shop. I'll go through everything. Just got some fruit and nuts to like snack on. And then the chocolate area because I love chocolate. And then the cookies obviously because... 
cookies. And then, so I have my Rich Piano 5% pre-workout, which isn't here, um, which I will be using. And then I have these isotonic, can you see? No, you can't see, but these, um, like I said, isotonic drinks. Got two of them in case I run out. And then, if worse comes to worse and I need some more caffeine, I have this Zero Calorie Monster, because... Yeah, calories don't count tomorrow, but I still don't want to be, like, dying. Um, this is my favourite sandwich in the whole world. It's from Bakery One, Bakery 16364? I don't know, I don't even know the name. Um, but it is a chicken and sweet potato and just goodness sandwich. It's huge. So this is what I'm going to be having after weighing. And then thanks Elspeth for the inspiration because I got some saurine, some sliced saurine. Because if everybody knows saurine is lovely and it's packed full of energy. And it's sliced. It's for just easiness. Um, so this is the food haul for tomorrow. And along with my pre-workout and this is what I will be snacking on during the day in theory. Yeah, so that is pretty much everything that I will be having after weigh-in tomorrow. Well, not everything, I'm not going to eat everything that's here, but little bits. And I'm not going to eat everything straight away because it'll just end badly, as in I'll be sick or my body just won't like it. I need to hydrate well so that that's the um, actual water and ice tonic drinks will be what I'll be having, but I think I may have um, about two hours, so I'll start lifting at about 10 um, before I actually start, like, actually lifting. So, um, we can get a good amount of food in then. That's the plan. Um, yeah, and I get to eat my cookies again. Cookies are my favourite things in the whole wide world. So, um, I will wrap up this talking part of the vlog. And I will just put in um, the, some training videos that I've done it, that are just little ones from the past two weeks. I think some are my openers and then some are me doing some 50% work in the last few days just as to not fatigue for today, um, tomorrow. And yeah, so I will leave you with that. So thank you to everyone that supported me so far. It's I've just I really appreciate it um, and we'll see how tomorrow goes hopefully fingers crossed I can get good lifts and hopefully I qualify for nationals if not what will be will be but fingers crossed and yeah so I will see you after the competition <laughs>
sonido. 